Okay, well, here's something I noticed um, months ago, um, and I never shared it because I, I, I thought it was kind of silly, but this morning I was fiddling around with this again, and I thought, yeah, I might as well just share this with some people that work on these electrostatic motors. And this is an electrostatic motor here. And uh, long ago, I, when I had another motor running, I set it next to the computer here, uh, just set it down, and all of a sudden it started rotating. And I'm looking at that going, you know, what's going on there? And what I thought at the time was coming out of the computer right down here is the exhaust vent for the fan. And I was wondering if I was picking up a charge that was transferring to the uh, brush on the electrostatic motor. And I got really excited. And I started working, working, working with it. And finally, uh, I decided it wasn't. It was just the air that was coming out of that and hitting that just right that made that spin. And I did a lot of tests with my little electroscope and uh, other things to see what, uh, what was going on. But um, it's a very interesting effect, and especially when you have something that looks like it's running electrostatically, but it's not. And uh, this is another one of those um, faked video techniques, is they've set up these really uh, low friction motors and they just blow on them uh, and it doesn't take a whole lot and this is just the air coming out of the vent of my computer that's causing that to rotate and uh, like I say this is um, nothing more than an electrostatic motor that um, has very very good bearings on it and you set it down just right in front of a, an air source and uh, It'll look like it's running on its own. <laughs> so anyway, I just wanted to kind of share that with uh, some of the guys that work on these electrostatic motors. That uh, I did for a time think that the air was picking up a charge as it blew across the uh, electronic guts of the laptop and hit that electrostatic motor. But it really isn't. And uh, I did a bunch of tests to make sure that this was not anything to do with electrostatic it's just air but uh, that's another way that the videos are faked is with the uh, air source some sort of an air source near a low friction rotor and you can make it spin and it looks like it's just running on its own thanks for watching